Hey everyone, welcome back to Wix Fix. I hope you're having a fantastic day. My name is Ryan. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can create checkout requirements so you can set min and max requirements for your products and your e-commerce website. So for example, if you offer a sample bundle of some of your products, you maybe don't want your users checking out with like 20 different samples. So it might be useful to be able to set a maximum number of samples that they can order. Or on the flip side, maybe you have one product that is just really expensive to ship. So maybe you can say you have to order a set number of this one product to be able to check out. So let's go ahead and see how we can set this up. So here I am inside of the dashboard for our e-commerce website and I created a fake product called product one lotion samples. So as you can see, it would come with three different products. Typically the samples would be smaller sizes of the bigger options, but we're going to go ahead and press save. Now I'm going to head on over to the editor and we're going to go to the app market inside the app market. I'm going to say checkout requirements. And we're going to see this app right here called Wix checkout requirements. So we're going to click on this and we're going to press add to site. Now we can't edit this from inside the editor. So it's going to have us go to the dashboard inside the dashboard. This is the page that we are going to see. So we're just going to press add requirement. We're going to set this to be a maximum quantity. We're going to set the quantity to maybe one or three. We'll do three. We want to apply this to not all products, but a specific product. So we're going to choose our samples option here, and we're going to call this one sample order maximum. And then underneath that, we'll have checkout behavior. So if a customer does not meet the requirements, then we want to disable the checkout and show an error message. And underneath that, we can set the error message that displays. So, so we can set the message to say something like there is a maximum amount of samples that you can order, and then we can press save. So now we have our maximum here. And if we come over to the live site, select our samples, and let's just say we choose four and add the cart. Then when we come to the cart, we'll see that there is a problem right here. It says there is a maximum amount of samples that you can order. So if we go ahead and lower this down to three, which is our maximum number, you can see that error message goes away and we are now able to check out. So as you can see, setting up a minimum and maximum requirements for checkout is actually really simple to do. I actually really do like this app and I love that they added it because it allows e-commerce to be able to build sample bundles or something like that for their users at a cheaper price so they can try out the products and hopefully have returning customers. But that's basically gonna wrap it up for today's quick little video. If you all did enjoy, please consider giving this video a like and subscribing to the channel for more Wix and Wix Studio content coming out really soon. I'd also like to give a special thanks to all the channel members. I really do appreciate you guys joining. And if you want to be able to see videos just like this, but before anybody else, then you can press that join button down below the video to become a channel member. But thank you guys again for watching and I will see you on the next one.